Hi, my name is Dana and I'm here at Yoga Spirit Circle and we prepared a 30 minute class for you that you can practice in the morning or whenever you feel like getting some extra energy in. It's approachable and accessible for most levels. You should have a little bit of yoga experience and uh, have fun with it. Let's get started. Let's start from our hands and knees. Come to your hands and knees and bring the hands shoulder distance apart, feet and knees hip distance apart. Tuck your toes under, lift the knees off the floor, and then push the seat back and up into a downward facing dog. We're gonna stay here for about five breaths. You can start deepening your breath and breathing with ujjayi, so an audible breath for you. Lift the pelvic floor to find mula bandha. Stay for three more. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhaling, three. Inhale, move the shoulders forward into a plank. Exhale, slowly back in a wave-like motion. Inhale, forward again. And curve the spine as you come forward. Exhale, slowly back. Inhale, take it forward. Exhale, this time, knees, chest, chin to the ground. Inhale, cobra. Bring the abdomen down, shoulders back, point your feet. Exhale, tuck your toes, sit back. Adho Mukha Svanasana, downward dog. Again, inhale, forward to plank. Firm the lower abdomen. Exhale, knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra. Point your feet. Exhale, tuck toes, sit back. Downward facing dog. Inhaling, plank. Stay here on your exhale. Make sure you're pushing the heels back, shoulders on top of the wrists. Dome the upper back, look forward. One, inhale. Exhale, two, strong legs, strong core. Inhale. Exhale, three. Now look forward, exhale, bend your elbows. Chaturanga Dandasana, stay. Inhale, upward dog. Try to lift your knees as you come up. Exhale, downward facing dog. Now take a few steps forward. And stop about 10 inches behind your wrists. Relax your head, press the feet down, press the hands down. And allow your neck to be soft here. You can do gentle movements from side to side. Or you just stay breathing in. And full breath out. One more, inhale. And exhale. Bend the knees, start rolling up. Take your time in slow motion. Stacking each vertebrae on top of the other. And then once you're up, step to the front of your mat. We meet in Tadasana. Bring your palms to touch and then find an intention for this practice. It's gonna be a short but sweet practice for you to start your day or feel a little bit more energized so maybe dedicate this time to someone or something that you would like to send this energy to. And then open your eyes, release your arms, Tadasana. Inhale, bring your arms up, palms together. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhale, look forward, prepare. Exhale, step back, bend your elbows, Chaturanga Dandasana. You can bring the knees down if straight legs is too much. Inhale, point your feet, upward dog. Exhale, take it back, downward dog. Five breaths here. Lift your sit bones, push the thighs back. One, inhale. Exhale, two, inhale. Exhaling, three, inhale. Exhale, four, inhale, exhale, five, bend your knees, look forward, inhale, step to the front, head up, exhale, folding, Uttanasana, inhale, lift up, lengthen, exhale, release, good, one more like this, inhale, reach up, exhale, fold, Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step or jump, Chaturanga Dandasana. 
Inhale. Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. Exhale, take it back. Downward dog. Five breaths. Breathing in. Breathe out. One. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Make sure you can hear your own breath. Three. Inhale. Exhale, four. Breathe in. Breathe out, five. Bend the knees, look forward. Inhale, lightly. Step or hop. Exhale, head down. Inhale, straight legs, lift up. And exhale, standing, Tadasana. One Jiva Mukti A, Sun Salutation. Hook your thumbs. Inhale, bring your arms up, arch back. Exhale, bend your knees, swing your arms through, interlace fingers, extend arms and legs. Inhale, bend knees, hands down, right foot back, lunging. Exhale, downward dog. Inhaling, plank pose, strong core. Exhale, bend your elbows. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Inhaling, plank. And exhale, knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra, slide forward. Exhale, tuck your toes, push the shoulders back, stay back, and then extend your legs. Inhale, right foot forward, lunge. Exhale, left foot forward, fold. Inhale, bend knees, hook thumbs, come to stand, straighten legs, arch, and exhale, reverse. Inhale, bend knees, hands down, left foot back, lunging. Exhale, downward dog. Inhaling, plank. Exhale, Chaturanga. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha. Don't forget, this is meant to warm you up. Exhale, Downward Dog. Inhale, Plank. Exhale, Knees, Chest, Chin. Inhale, Cobra. Shoulders back. Exhale, Tuck Toes. Seat back to heel. Downward Dog. Inhale, Left Foot Forward. Exhale, Right Foot Forward, Fold. Inhale, Bend Knees, Hook Thumbs. Come to stand, straighten your legs. Arch from the chest. Exhale, standing. Surya Namaskar B. Inhale, bend the knees. Utkatasana. Exhale, hands down. Uttanasana. Inhale, lengthen. Press the hands down. Exhale, step or hop back. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, downward dog. Inhale, right foot forward. Back heel turns down. Lift up, warrior one. Keep the palms together. Exhale, hands down, step back. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha. Exhale, Adha Mukha. Inhale, left foot forward, coming up. I'm going to give you a variation. If you just want to do the regular, stay with it. Exhale, hands down, plank. And then bring the knees down, do a half push up. Inhale, point your feet. And exhale, Adha Mukha. We stay in down dog, five breaths. Breathing in. Exhale for one. Inhale. You can gaze between your thighs or to the navel. Two. Inhale. Exhale. Three. Inhale. Exhale. Four. Inhale. Exhaling, five, bend the knees. Inhale, step or hop. Exhale, folding. Inhale, bend the knees deeply. And exhale, standing Tadasana. Bring your feet as wide as your mat. Turn the toes out and then come into a squat. Sit the hips down. Start moving a little bit from side to side. Make sure the inside of your knees is pushing out and the inside of your feet is lifting up. So the arches of your feet. I'll lift it. Stay here one. Inhale. Exhale two. Inhale. Exhaling three. Good. Bring the hands down. Extend the legs. Heel toe your feet to hip distance. Take hold of your big toes. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, drop the head, upper body down. Parangustasana. Breathe in. Breathe out, one, inhale, 
Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale. Exhale, four. Inhale. Exhaling, five. Inhale, extend your arms. Exhale, here. Bring your hands to your waist. Inhale, lift up and exhale, feet together at the top of your mat. Open to the long side of your mat. Step one foot back and then turn the right foot out, left foot in. Make sure the front heel and the middle of your back foot are in one line. Lift your arms, inhale, exhale, pull yourself forward, bring the right hand down, support it on the shin or on a block, take the left arm up. Inhale here, exhale for one, inhale, exhale two, inhale, exhale three, inhale, Exhale, four, inhale, exhale, five, look down, lift yourself up, inhale here, exhale, bend the right knee and widen the stance, inhale, look over your right hand, make sure both hands are pointing to the front and back, sit a little deeper, warrior two, one, inhale, exhale, two, Inhale, exhale, three, breathe in, breathe out, four, inhale, exhale, five, inhale, straighten the right leg, exhale, bend it again, this time bring your right hand to the outside of your right foot, if that's too much, you can bring your right elbow to the knee, Take your left arm up, inhale here, and then bring it over your ear. You want to rotate the chest up towards the sky. Try to turn your right chest all the way up. One, inhale, take the chin a little bit in. Two, breathe in, breathe out three, inhale, exhale four, Inhale, exhale, five, lift yourself up, breathe in, and exhale, hands to your waist, change the position of your feet. Shorten the stance a little bit for Trikonasana, inhale, arms up, exhale, come over your left leg, left hand down, right arm up. Now you want to find length in both sides of the rib cage. turn the chest to face towards the long edge of your mat, and your right arm straight up, one, Inhale, exhale two, breathe in, breathe out three, inhale, exhale four, deep breath, exhale five, look down, inhale, lift, exhale, bend the left knee. Viyavadrasana two. Sit the hips low, make sure your left thigh is parallel to the floor, and then turn both thighs outward, outward rotation. The tailbone down, pubic bone up. Keep Mula Bandha engaged. Hold it here, one. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three. It's a strong position. Hold your legs. Four. Breathe in. And breathe out for five. Inhale, extend. Exhale, bend again, left hand outside of left foot. Parsha Konasana. Again, optional elbow to knee. Bring the right arm up and then take it over. Find the side stretch here. The right side body is lengthening. One. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three, breathe in, nice breath, keep it going, four, inhale, exhale, five, this time both hands down, 
Take up your back heel. Inhale, step into plank. Exhale, Chaturanga Dandasana. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. Exhale, take it back. Adho Mukha Svanasana. Hold for three breaths. Breathe in. Breathe out. One. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three. Bend the knees, look forward. Inhale, step or hop. Exhale, folding. Inhale, bend the knees deeply, chair. And exhale, standing, Tadasana. Go find a spot at a wall if you have one. For a handstand at the wall. Shorten the down dog, bring your hands to the wall. And then take a few jumps, up and down, or you stay up and hold it here. You can also do handstand in the room if that's available for you. Ten breaths. One. Inhale. Exhale. Two. Relax your head if you're at the wall. Three. Four. Good. If you're jumping, jump up and down. Don't give up. Six. <laughs> Inhale. Exhale. Seven. I probably left five out. Doesn't matter. Exhale. Eight. Inhale. Exhale. Nine. Last breath. And exhale, 10. Good, once you come out, relax your head, hanging over the legs. Enjoy the feeling. And then find your way back to the top of your mat in Tadasana. Inhale, bend the knees, Utkatasana. Exhale, twisting to the right, Paravita Utkatasana. Press your palms together, lift your chest, look up to the sky. Stay for one. You want to make sure your feet and knees are in line. Two. Breathe in. Exhale, three. Inhale, center. Arms up. Exhale, change sides. Twist to the left. Inhale. Exhale, one. Inhale. Exhale, two. Inhale. Exhale, three. Inhale, center. Arms up. This time, fold forward. Exhale. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, walk back into a downward facing dog. Good. Lift the right leg up. And now bend the knee. Turn the hip outward. You can go really high with the right knee so you find a nice stretch in the front of your right thigh. And lengthen the right side of your torso. Inhale, extend the right leg. Exhale. This time, bring the right foot between your hands. Bend, bring the left knee down. Inhale, left arms. Torso up. You want to make sure both knees are in a 90 degree angle. Tailbone down, pubic bone up. Twist to your right side. Palms together again. If you do other arm variations, that's fine for me. Press the palms together. Lift your chest to the thumbs. And then optional, extend the back leg. Inhale. Exhale for one. Inhale. Exhale two. Inhale. Exhale three. Inhale. Exhale four. Inhale. Exhale five. Bring the hands down. Step back, right leg up again. Inhale, nice and long. Exhale here. Good. Breathe in. Look forward to your hands. Bring the right knee to your nose. Shoulders over wrists. Inhale up. Exhale forward again. Inhale up. Exhale. Listen. This time bring your leg forward and then to the left side. Flex the right foot. Turn the foot to the outer edge. Left heel comes down. Inhale. Lift the left arm. Exhale here. One. Inhale. If you need more, you can lift your lower leg. Two. Inhale. I don't need more today. Three. Four. And five. Both hands come down. Step back. Downward dog. Beautiful. Inhale, left leg up. Bend your knee. Turn the hip out. Now, this is supposed to be a really nice stretch for your hip. Enjoy. 
then extend and step the left foot forward, right knee down. Inhale, left arms, torso up, tailbone down, pubic bone up. Find that activation through the lower abdomen. Take your right arm up and then twist to your left side, palms together, and when you're ready, extend. Inhale, exhale one, inhale, exhale two, inhale, exhale three, inhale, exhale four, inhale, Exhale, five, both hands down. Inhale, step back, left leg up, open the hip here. And now exhale, knee to nose, shoulders forward. Good, dome the upper back, inhale back. One more time, exhale, inhale back. And this time bring the knee to center, cross the leg. Foot to the left side, turn the right heel down, inhale, lift. Exhale, right arm comes up, one. Breathe in, breathe out two, inhale, exhale three, two more, inhale, exhale four, enjoy, inhale, mm, exhale five, both hands come down, step back, downward facing dog. Find a way to come to sit, you can walk through or you bend the knees, look forward, jump, bring the feet through, flex your feet. Inhale here, lift your chest nice and long, lower abdomen in, exhale, fold forward. Prashimuttanasana, seated forward fold. Now it's not important if you can hold your feet right from the beginning, you can also bend the knees, make sure you have the abdomen and your thighs relatively close together, and then once you feel that the body is opening up more, you can go deeper. I'm gonna stay here for maybe Another eight breaths, so you can allow the back of your legs to open, let go a little bit. Inhaling, slowly lift up, bring your hands behind you, bend the knees, feet parallel and hip distance. On your inhale, you lift the hips, and then when you can't see the knees anymore, drop your head back. Allowing the throat to open here. Inhale, head up, exhale, sit down and find your way back into a downward facing dog. Good. Move your head from left to right. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Maybe. Inhaling to plank pose. Exhale, knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra. This time extend your arms back. Interlace your fingers. Lift the legs, your arms, your neck, everything up. Follow the movement of the spine with your neck. One. Two. Three. Four, lift the legs a little higher. Exhale, five, release. Hands next to chest, open your feet hip distance. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhaling to plank. Exhale, through chaturanga, onto your abdomen. Bend the knees, reach back for your ankles. If this is too much, you can do the same thing we did before. Inhale, lift the knees, chest, everything up. One, danurasana, bow. Two, try to keep your big toes touching. Three, drishti is the nose. Four. And five, release. Hands next to chest. 
Inhale, upward dog. And exhale, take it back, downward dog. Bend the knees, look forward. Find your way to a seated position. And then bring your feet to the floor, extend your arms forward. We're going to roll down in slow motion. So try to keep your toes down. Roll down, roll down, roll down. Take your time. Really use your abdomen. Use core strength. Once you're down, extend your arms over your ears. Touch the floor with your thumbs. Bring your arms back up. Slowly back. Inhale up. Slowly. Don't lift your feet. Don't lift your feet. Don't lift your feet. Yes. Come up. And then one more time. Go down. With control. With control. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Good. Once you're down, hold the edges of your mat. Bring the feet in. Set them up close to your hips. You should be able to touch your heels with your fingertips. Lift your upper, uh, your hips, your lower, your middle, upper back, and then you can move the shoulders a little bit under your chest, if that's okay for your neck. If you have a very stiff neck, never mind. Just do what feels good for your neck, okay? Keep pushing the hips up. And release. Okay. So the next asana is wheel or half wheel. You can do the same thing we just did for half wheel. If you want to come with me into wheel, bring your arms alongside your ears, bend your elbows, and set up your hands next to the ears. Now, I always like to emphasize, don't bring your hands all the way to the ears because that's too tight. Leave a little bit of space. Elbows are pointing straight up. Imagine someone is moving your arms towards the area behind your head. And then lift your hips. Come up in one, move, in one movement. Push the hands down. Relax your head. Stay for one. Two. Three. Four. And five. Chin to chest. Carefully come down. Good. Once you're down, bring your hands to the lower abdomen. If you feel you need one more, please go ahead. We'll have very different energy levels depending what time of the day you're going, to, you're going to practice this class. So if it's in the morning, I always like to give a little bit more energy into back bends because they will set you up for a good day. And if it's in the evening, maybe a bit less. Bring the knees into chest when you're finished. Give yourself a little squeeze. And then take both legs up. Wrap your right leg around the left. Double wrap if possible. You have to bend the knees for this. Move your hips to the right, knees to the left. Bring the knees at least to the level of your navel or even higher and then twist. Supine twist. Now the right shoulder might stay lifted here. That's totally fine. You can use your breath to work it closer to the floor. Inhale, lift back up. Undo the legs, change sides, hips to left, knees to right, and then twisting. You can already start to calm the breath a little bit, cooling down. It's connected to your own energy, prana is what the yogis call it. Prana is life force. We move prana through us every day, all day, no matter if we're awake or if we're asleep. Bring the legs up, knees to chest. Find your way into a seated position. I'm going to finish the practice with a few moments in meditation. So find a comfortable seat. If you want to take this moment lying down, feel free. Otherwise, stay seated. Eyes closed.
And we're going to take three breaths together to so release Ujjayi breath and come into a passive form of breathing. Take a full breath in. Hold it. Open your mouth and release. Again, inhale. Hold. Release. Last time, inhale, lift, hold. And drop everything. Rest your hands on your lap. Allow the breath to flow without any effort. No control. No strategy, no counting, just free. And take these moments to observe. Observe your breath without changing it. Observe if you have any thoughts coming up. Thoughts about your day. Thoughts about the practice. And then see if you can just not get too much into the thought. Imagine it was a book in a bookshelf and you maybe read the title but you don't open the book. You don't even touch it. You just walk by. Do this with every thought. Bring your palms together and bring your forehead down as a gesture of gratitude. When you're ready, open your eyes. Thank you very much for practicing with me. And I hope to see you online or in person. Thank you. Mm -hmm.